high scorpions come in the den close the door behind you because i don't want nobody you know lurking all right because we're here to talk about your life for the month of august any place with a scorpio sun moon mercury rising venus mars jupiter saturn north node and south no places that anybody who would like to be nosy they are in here thank you guys for all the continued support bookings like shares comments subscribes recommendations tips all that i really appreciate it i have recently introduced birth chart readings okay i consider it to be your blueprint and i'm very shocked and appreciative of everybody that's been booking them with me. I really appreciate that. I'm currently doing them for $35.35. $35. That's my rollout price, girl. You know, it'll only be that way for a limited time only. All right, so book while you can. Um, and I'm currently doing monthly readings for $40.40. They're usually $50.50, but I'm doing them for $40.40 for the time being. Pricing and contact information to book those readings with me is in the description box down below. All the info will be in the pinned comment in the comment section. Like the video and subscribe. Please. It's going to keep me in your rotation. Dashing. So, Scorpio, what we're going to do is pull three zodiac signs and see what place which you guys might have, who could be around you during this time, who could be being nosy, and then we're going to pull one monthly Oracle message card to see what your overall energy is during this time. Heads up! Um, I shuffled the tarot deck before I started reading for you guys, and King of Pentacles popped out, so some of y'all could be dealing with the Earth sign, or they could be an Earth sign in the vicinity, okay? Spirit guys, what zodiac signs can resonate with this Scorpio reading for the month of August in the year 2023? All right, blah, blah, blah. All right. So, Scorpio, could there be another Scorpio being nosy during this time in the back? Could be. Or, whenever I see the sign of the zodiac that I'm reading for, that means you could have any placement of said zodiac and some messages in here could definitely resonate with you. So, any placement of Scorpio or the eighth house. Taurus, Capricorn, and Aries. Did I not say there could be an earth sign around you during this time? Is it a coincidence that two earth signs show up, Taurus and Capricorn? You can't make this shit up. You better book, okay? Well, I don't want to tell you what to do, girl. It's, it's your decision. So we got Taurus, Capricorn, and Aries. Taurus and Capricorn moon, but Aries sun. Okay, you guys can have these placements. These zodiac signs can be around you during this time, and they could also be some messages for you in these monthly readings. Spirit guys, what's going on with the Scorpio zodiac for the month of August in the year twenty? This law of attraction card keep coming out. All right. So please be aware of your energetic output. What are you putting effort, energy, um, towards? All right. What are you allowing around you during this time? Spirit guides, what's going on with the Scorpio Zodiac for the month of August in the year 2023? Oh, girl. Mm, really? We got enemies, bitch. We got enemies, Scorpio. Snakes in the grass with keep it low key some of y'all need to be careful because people that you know might have secret animosity towards you of course probably won't give it away you know what i mean um some of y'all could have people around you who secretly envy you who are secretly jealous of you secretly don't want something to work out for you keep it low key you need to make sure that you aren't letting um any and everybody in on your goals dreams and aspirations because some of y'all got some people around y'all who are looking to take 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 okay or looking to just kind of benefit off of the fruits of your labor, okay? I feel like my knee got a pop, girl. Oh, I'm so old. Uh, Spirit guys, what's going on with the Scorpio Zodiac for the month of August in the year 2023? Page of Cups with the star. Oh, okay, 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 okay. What's going on here? Okay, all right. Um, some of you guys might have been a little bit more emotional as of uh, recently because with the star and the death card, you've been going through some sort of rebirth slash resurrection. Um, 
eight of wands things around you have been changing pretty fast okay there's been a lot of um switch changes going on with you during this time um some of y'all have been facing some financial hardship three of swords and the two of pentacles certain things that you've been investing your time effort and energy um into really haven't been turning out the way that you want them to but with the star card and the death card i'm hearing this all the part of the process okay Spirit guys, what's going on with the Scorpio Zodiac for the month of August in the year 20? I thought I saw something in the year 2023. <sighs> if I had pearls, I'd clutch and bitch. Okay, 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 okay. We can work with it. We got the devil and we have judgment. Now, judgment is your energy, Scorpio. And judgment for me is do the right thing. What would Jesus do, basically? Page of Cups and the Devil card. Um, some of you guys, there's been some sort of tempting situation that, of course, is toxic and a detrimental for you um, that you've been dealing with during this time. Okay, and with the Judgment card, it's kind of been like a battle, uh, head versus heart, good angel versus bad angel. You um, trying to avoid leaning into your desires, your urges, your impulses, okay, versus what you should be doing versus doing the right thing. Um, now, some of y'all, this is dealing with a toxic love connection. It could be with a fellow water sign or an earth sign individual. Um, you know, the page of cups for me is the dick on your face card. In this um, deck, it's more about leading more with your heart versus your head. And this could get you in a sticky situation because it's beside the devil card. Like I said, kind of um, putting the flesh above logic. All right. A uh, page of wands and the queen of pentacles. Some of y'all, this is in regards to um, how you're managing your financial stability. I don't know if you got a shopping problem, a spending problem, bad money management, girl. You need to get it together. No disrespect, but you might need to get it together. Um, some of y'all, this is like I said, dealing with a toxic connection. Um, I'm, see I'm seeing a lot of childish shit going on between you and someone, Scorpio. If, th if this is going on currently or it has gone on. And I just feel like it's best for you to probably, you know... What are they saying you should do? Well, judgment card for me is, you know, make the right decision. So it's probably leaving the shit alone. Probably. Okay. Spirit guys, what's going on with the Scorpio Zodiac for the month of August? Oh, in the year 2023. Four of Swords with the Tower. Yeah, some of y'all are being called to kind of like ice out certain impulses, desires that you have during this time. It's like basically ignore it, okay? Don't fall to temptation. Don't don't succumb to the temptation, Scorpio. Tower, seven of wands, and the knight of cups. Yeah, it's like we're going to go into the burning building. We're gonna go into a bad situation. We're gonna purposely make bad decisions. That's 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 not that's not where it's at. Okay. Uh Tower of Seven of Wands and the Knight of Cups. Now, you can do whatever you want to do though. Okay, so sometimes the universe will allow you to fuck up, will allow you to walk into a bad situation because you have discernment. You know better. You know what you should and shouldn't do, right? So don't be surprised if things wind up, you know, crumbling and falling. Um, after you, do, you know, knowingly decide to make a bad decision, right? Knowing that seven, to, seven of wands should have stayed your ass away from this. Uh, some of y'all, if this is dealing with a person, is definitely fellow water, earth, or air sign individual, Libra, Capricorn, Gemini, Taurus. Yeah, ten of swords. It's time for you to get out of the burning building, Scorpio. Some of y'all, it's time for you to make changes in your life in regards to any sort of thing going on to where it's like you can see the fall happening, okay? London Bridge is falling, girl. You're being urged to go ahead and start making some lifestyle uh, changes. It could be in regards to health, because four swords is out here. It could be in regards to um, who you're dealing with. It could be in regards to, like I said, money management, okay? It's like, are we going to keep entertaining these self-destructive tendencies? Or with the ten of swords, had we had enough, Scorpio? Have we had enough? Have we had enough? Spirit guys, what's going on with the Scorpio Zodiac for the month of God damn. 
booty up, so I'm not going to read it. Spirit guys, what's going on with the Scorpio Zodiac for the month of August in the year 2023? Moon. So some of y'all could have Scorpio moon, or you could have a mother that is a Scorpio. Or some sort of feminine energy around you that's a Scorpio. It doesn't have to be a mom. Three of Pentacles in reverse. Knight of Pentacles. Six of Cups. Um... There's a certain way of working and or managing things, Scorpio, that you're going to move on from. Uh, you're going to figure out a better way to handle things. All right? It's almost like you was doing things either the easy way. Excuse me. Yeah, I'm here and taking easy street rather than uh, getting on the horse. Okay? No pun intended. It's like you move out of the Three of Pentacles energy and then you move into the Knight of Pentacles energy to where it's like, as you can see, they're stationary in the Three of Pentacles, whereas the Knight of Pentacles, while it moves slow, it's in motion, slow motion, bad and no motion. I walked in the crib, got two kids, and my baby mama late. Uh-oh. I hope they ain't the case with somebody. Well, girl, I don't know what your situation is. Um, but some of y'all, it's like um, you got to get some things in motion. You got to start getting these things on paper, off paper, and putting some action towards it. Speaking of, girl, I be, I be, I be, girl, I be reading The Magician. You got to start putting some things in action. And Scorpio, this is technically your card. Um, now, some of y'all might have been slow to do this because of insecurity. Um, moon card, page of cups, and the devil card. Will it be good enough? Will I be good enough? What if things don't turn out well? Well, would you rather look back and say, I'm glad I did that versus I wish I would have done that? For a source, some of y'all got to get rid of the insecurity that you have in regards to getting something off the ground here. You putting something into motion, all right? Real random. Uh, Scorpio, I'm seeing there's someone here that decided not to deal with you anymore because they didn't like your caution. Um, your caution. They didn't like the fact that you were um, cautious in regards to Three of Pentacles, um, doing business with them, collaborating with them. They didn't like that. It's almost, yeah, the devil card is out here, Paige, because it's like somebody here wanted you to be a simp. Somebody here just wanted you to just submit to them, no questions asked. Yeah. You probably already found that to be off. Okay, moon card is uh, right here. And you was like, mm, yeah, something's weird. Something's weird. Why do you just want me to just say yes, basically, without me reading the terms and conditions of the contract? Now, some of y'all, this could be like a legit policy, okay? Somebody like, well, you got to the end of the day to decide. I'm not the one to be rushed, okay? Or some of y'all, this is in regards to a person, and that's how you know you was dealing with a narcissist, a toxic individual, a karmic, as they would say, because someone here didn't appreciate you having questions. Someone didn't appreciate you having boundaries. Someone didn't appreciate you not just rushing into shit with them. What's your overall energy? Snakes in the grass. You knew, girl. The, the, the antennas, they be, they, be, they be doing that whenever people be off. Spirit guys, what's going on with the, who is this? Mike Jones. Spirit guys, what's going on with the Scorpio Zodiac for the month of August in the year 2023? Eight of Wands with the Nine of Cups. Nine minus seven equals two of Cups. Uh, which is about connections. Scorpio, there have been or is a certain connection um, to where, I'm telling you, devil card in the eight of wands, somebody here wanted something to move way too fast with you. And because I feel like you had doubts, nine of cups and the uh, seven of cups, right? You were you were right to have doubts. Because with the devil card in the eight of wands, this for me is someone here who's um hot, hot and ready. Ain't that girl, ain't that Little Caesars? Oh, girl, and cheap, ew, okay? Yeah, this is someone here who would choose quantity over quality, okay? Um, I feel like you probably dodged a bullet um, not going into business with someone, not establishing some sort of relationship with someone, whether it be friendly or romantic um, or kin, kinship-wise, you know, trying to build a connection with, a, like, a family member or something like that. Because the devil in the eight of wands, I feel like this person only moves with their own intentions in mind 
You know what I mean? They're not thinking about others. They're only thinking about what they're going to get out of this, okay? So with the Eight of Cups and the Tower card, you actually avoided going into the burning building with someone. Heavy on the fellow water, earth, or fire. So far, I got Sagittarius, Aries, Capricorn. And like I said, any um, fellow water sign. And some of y'all, this is having to do with you, okay? Having to ask yourself, am I doing things out of sheer ego, um, want, desire, or am I doing things according to what I can, one, afford, uh, to what I'm supposed to be doing, okay? It's like, are you moving in a strategic way or are you just moving in a way that you just want to move, okay? Spirit guys, what's going on with the, who is this? Scorpio Zodiac. I got the worst memory. What's going on with the Scorpio Zodiac for the month of August in the year 2023? Five of Wands with the Page of Wands. Whatever it is that you're keeping low key about um, whatever moves that you could be keeping low key during the sign Scorpio, I would advise that still keep it low key with the five of wands. You are running into obstacles or you will, I sound like Scooby fucking do, or you will run into obstacles, um, with these plans, with these goals that you have, but are you going to let that keep you from pursuing things? Cause with the devil card showing up, yeah, he going to get in the way whenever, you know, things will get in your way whenever you're trying to be better. Whenever you're trying to do the right thing, you'll always be tempted to go in the other direction, right? But it's up to you, you to know. I was about to say to rock up. Let's let's not do that, okay? Not while the window's open. But it's up to you to be able to kind of like ice out those desires, ice out those impulses, and you know, still um do things. I'm really scared about saying this word, but I'm going to say this anyway, righteously, okay? Doing things the right way, basically. Not your way, the right way. You got some secret enemies around you, Scorpio. Moon card, devil, and the five of wands. Like, uh, people who kind of see you as competition uh, with the four swords. This for me is like they might not publicly give you a like or give you a congratulations, but they'll be in the DMs. Congratulations. Or oh, this is, you know, being friends with someone who never um, celebrates you. You know what I'm saying? Uh, whether it be publicly or privately. It's like someone here would rather give you your uh, flowers in private rather than publicly. Or someone just never gives you your flowers, but they still tune in. They still entertain you. They still show interest in you, right? That's a hater. That's a hater, Scorpio. You need to be careful about people like that who are around you. Because with the Eight of Wands, it's like you're not the only one here that's trying to get to the prize. You're not the only one here that's trying to get to the bag. You're not the only one here who's trying to um, do things with your life. And you have some people here who want to outdo you, who want to do it before you, who want to do it better than you. And you're just like, girl, I just want to, I just want to create. Girl, I just want to, I just want to do my thing. You're not even on that type of time. So here, guys, what's going on with the Scorpio Zodiac for the month of August in the year 2023? Ace of Cups, stay hydrated, my friends, okay, and moisturize with the Three of Wands on the bottom of the deck. Page of Cups, Moon card, and the Ace of Cups. Yeah, please keep all your um, dreams, passions to yourself. Not everybody needs to know about them, okay? Eight of Wands and the Four of Swords. Or... At least keep them to yourself until you know you're in a room with people who, you know, you resonate with, who aren't looking to steal your ideas, who aren't looking to battle you. So what the fuck is this? You got served? Like, what, what is this? Okay. Um... Also, like I said, some of you guys might realize that there are certain connections with people that won't last because with the five of wands, one, people see you as competition or two, people see you as someone here who gives too much pushback. Okay, now that you're hard to deal with, it's just some people would rather have yes men around them. Some people would rather have people who just let them do whatever 
and don't hold them accountable for anything. So don't be surprised if you've pushed, been pushed out of certain rooms, um, connections because of you being that individual. It's okay. Don't stop being that way because all you're doing is weeding out the people from around you who don't belong around you, okay? People who kind of just want you to just keep quiet and look pretty. Girl, what? I have more than that. Okay, I have brains too. Spirit guys, what's going on with the Scorpio Zodiac for the month of August in the year 2023? Strength. Mm -hmm. And it's lining up with the devil. Devil, eight of wands, and the strength card. Yeah. With the page of pentacles, like I said, some of y'all got to practice better money management or you're trying to. There's things that you want to do with your money. There's things you want to spend your money on. There's things that you want to have in your hands. Okay, with the strength card, you got to be able to tell yourself no, either not right now or not at all. Okay. Because it's beside and it's beside the ace of cups. It's like what's more important, this short term satisfaction or long term satisfaction? Okay, basically instant gratification or long term satisfaction. Uh, I couldn't figure out something else to say. Last card, spirit guys. What's going on with the Scorpio zodiac for the month of August in the year twenty twenty three? Justice with the Three of Swords. Um, some of y'all also gotta uh figure out which battles you wanna fight. Like, what's worth you uh putting up a fight for? Like, there's certain things that's not worth you, you know, going uh hella hard for. All right. Um, four swords, five ones. It's like. You constantly trying to give to a certain situation to where it's like you'll always be the bad guy. You'll always be, you know, taken advantage of. You'll always be overworked. You'll always be um, kind of like the butt of the joke. And with the page of cuss, you got to kind of be willing to just accept that. Not accept it in regards to you dealing with it, but just accepting like maybe this ain't your lane. Maybe this ain't your room. Maybe this ain't your, maybe these people ain't your people. Maybe this isn't a space you should be in. Not try even harder to put, you know, what is it, what is it called? Putting a square, a square uh, nug into a, a circle hole, something like that. Because with the three of soldiers, you wind up heartbroken. This goes for certain connections to where someone here keeps taking advantage of you. Someone here keeps putting you in bad situations. Um, like I said, you keep giving to something that's just taking, taking, taking from you. Are you going to be silly? And with the page of cups, just keep giving? Because for, I don't know, girl. Uh, well, with the moon card and the ace of cups, it's like this secret energy of wanting to be accepted, understood, valued, right? But you got to have that with self, with, uh, within self. If you continue looking for it outside of yourself, you will be taken advantage of, okay? People will see you with someone that they can use and abuse. Also, like I said, some of y'all, this is a self thing to where you got to start asking yourself, um, are... The ways that I'm, you know, me doing things my way really putting me in circumstances to where I can flourish or am I just holding myself back rather than making those changes in life that I know I need to make? Scorpio, this was your August monthly reading. Any placement of Scorpio, but Scorpio Moon was out here the strongest. Like the video, leave a comment telling me if this resonated with you in any way. Subscribe to the channel. My pricing and contact information is in the description box down below. All the info will be in the pinned comment in the comment section. I'll talk to you later. Bye.